Customer orders to be shipped tomorrow. Let's check them out. Let's grab 12894 for Brandon Maltavo and 11944 a PS5. Let's go check these out in the lab. We do a lot of PS5 here, but recently we've seen an uptick in Xbox and even some PS4, believe it or not, still very popular controller. 12894 PS5 Hulk edition. Very clean, man. I'll tell you what, soft touch everything too. Soft touch green front shell, uh, touch pad middle, even has the new Cinch Gaming mouse click triggers. You guys may have missed this in our last video, but I was talking about how these are brand new and exclusive to Cinch Gaming. Like a lot of companies use the same triggers from overseas or a certain website. We actually developed our own uh, using an engineering team that uh, designed these for us and they are phenomenal. I think it's the shortest trigger throw of any controller. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty positive. I have to do some internal testing before I start making claims, but man, these things are snappy. I'll tell you what. Also, soft touch back, very clean, very clean. I'm gonna give that a 9.2 out of 10. Love it, love it. 11994 PS5, ooh, swap thumbsticks. I like how the white is on the left and the purple is on the right. Plus it has different color rings. Purple ring with the white thumbstick, white ring with the purple thumbstick. Awesome, awesome build. Plus our brand new mouse triggers, which I just showed off a minute ago. Cinch grip is white and it has two action buttons. I like to see the action buttons there, I'll tell you what. Probably this one's jump and that one's crouch. I almost guarantee that's what most people do. I have to check. But yeah, white home button. This thing is killer, man, killer. Plus the blue LEDs look really sick on there. It's got everything, you know? I'm gonna give it a, well, it doesn't have mouse click face buttons, but I can't deduct points for not having a feature, right? If you had to rate that controller, on a scale from one to 10, what would it be? Let me know in the comments. And what would you do differently if you had the option to? More controllers in all the time. I usually show those off in the videos, but box stack of Xbox controllers there. Those are empty boxes that are gonna be shipped with orders. All right, we're gonna do a, we're gonna do a little test here. Who has the cleanest build station? Dominic, very clean. Christian, kinda also very clean. Some orders on his desk too. Tanner, our, one of our testers. Ah, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's decently clean. Uh, Kelsey, build sheet. But yeah, Kelsey keeps his stuff pretty clean, man. I'll tell you what, very clean guy. We have Brody, also pretty clean. And then a couple more builders. Josh also does building. Yeah, this is, this is pretty clean, pretty clean. He edits films. Then you have my desk, which is obviously the cleanest here. Look at this, very, very clean desk. Checkbook just sitting out, remarkable too. The best thing I ever bought, I'll tell you what. And yeah, very clean. Also kind of like an Optimus Prime Transformers themed controller for somebody I know with back buttons and mouse triggers. Very cool. Yeah, this is a very, very clean station, don't you think? On over here, who does shipping? Very, very clean, plus an unreleased all product. Very, very clean station, don't you think? Or could it use some cleaning? But you know, when customer orders have to go out, so there's always stuff on that desk. Or is it Jenny's desk? Or is it Deanie's desk? Also very clean. Phil's desk, pretty clean, I'll tell you what. Then we have Jenny's desk, keeps her stuff very much in order. Is it Brittany's desk also using an unreleased alt product and the alt mouse? Pretty clean, I'll give you what. This is Jamie's desk, also very clean. Very nice, very nice. And then we have Randy's desk, also decently clean with the T69 alt keyboard, brand new. RGBs throughout, volume knob, I'll link them below. That's also us, we do keyboards and all kinds of stuff here. See, we have all of our keycaps, mouse pad, press room behind me. More inventory over here, I'll show you while I'm backing up, I don't hit something. All rows of inventory throughout tons and tons of keyboards. A couple of our testing check sheets here. Tester puts those in with the orders when he tests them. But yeah, that is today's video. Thank you very much for watching, supporting our business. It's all possible because of you. We just hit 400K subscribers. I will see you in the next one.